So I was finishing painting my plate and I used, I decided to use my green again around my purple. So um, to finish it out, I, uh, that is what I used. And as you get out here to this edge, it's really bumpy. And so you're gonna have to paint back over things a little bit to fill in all the white. Um, and something else that I wanted to mention as we're finishing a painting um, is to make sure you're wiping your brush off in between colors so that you won't drip over other people's pictures. And what I mean by that is when you're swishing and you get done, um, I want you to br wipe your brush off on the edge of the cup like this. Don't tap, because if you tap, you're going to splatter dirty water on somebody. Let's wipe on the edge. Um, I'm going to go back in with some of my colors that we've already used and add some little designs on top of the plate. Um, and my example that's already finished has those type of things. We can use little lines, little dots around the outside. Dots would be great since we're celebrating dot day. So around the edge here, I'm going to put some little designs. So I'm going to use a different color so we can see it. And I'm just going to use the very tip of my brush. I'm not going to mash it down a lot. I just make some little dots on top of my orange there. Okay. Now I'm going to swish, hold my cup, wipe, and just for extra measure, squeeze it out in the paper pack. All right. So next, I'm going to see if I can maybe put something on top of this blue. And blue is such a dark color. Um, it's going to be hard to find something that will go on top of it. But blue and orange usually look really good together. So I'm going to try some orange. And I'm going to make some little lines like sun, sun rays going around it. It kind of makes that look like a sunshine in the middle. And if your blue is still wet, when you're doing this, or any of your colors are still wet, don't scrub it back and forth. You see Miss Brooks is painting in one direction. If you scrub it back and forth, your colors will mix, so we don't want that. All right, we're gonna clean our brush. And you can put little designs in any of the sections. Um, I want you to put it in at least three places. So I'm gonna put at least one more. You can put it in all of them if you want to, but you absolutely don't have to. Um, I'm going to put some yellow dots in my purple. And I'm just dabbing that on. I'm not going to scrub it. I'm not going to rub it in. Because if I rub it, it's going to blend with my other paint that's already there. And sometimes that doesn't make such a pretty color when you do that. So I'm finished. You can be finished if you've done at least three sections um, with little designs. But if you want to do more, you can do it in every single little section like Miss Brooks did on this one um, and fix them up and decorate them. And then when you're done, we're going to carry this to the drying rack to dry. And we'll be finished.